Casper is a legendary mine resistant ambush protected vehicle designed and developed in South Africa during the late 1970s and officially entered service in the 1980s. Since its inception, the Casper has become a cornerstone of military and police operations, recognized for its exceptional ability to protect its occupants from mice, improvised explosive devices, and small arms fire. The vigorous, durable design and adaptability have ensured its continued relevance in modern warfare, making it one of the most iconic MRAP vehicles ever developed. The Casper's V-shaped hull design was a pioneering innovation specifically designed to mitigate the devastating effects of mine explosions. The hull directs the blast force away from the crew compartment, significantly enhancing the survivability of the vehicle's occupants. With raised charges, the vehicle's high ground clearance adds an additional layer of protection by distancing the crew from the immediate impact of a mine explosion beneath the vehicle. The Casper can carry a crew of two, including the driver and commander, along with up to 12 additional soldiers and their equipment. It is equipped with bullet-resistant windows, firing ports, and a rear-mounted exit door, allowing for quick ingress and aggress. Roof hatches provide a platform for soldiers to engage in fire support roles using mounted machine guns or water cannons when necessary. Powered by turbocharged diesel engine, the Casper is designed for long-range operations with a maximum range of 770 km and a top speed of 100 km per hour. Its 4x4 suspension system allows it to traverse difficult terrains, making it well suited for off-road operations. The vehicle is also capable of forting water obstacles and negotiating steep gradients, further enhancing its adaptability in harsh environments, particularly in arid and rugged landscapes of Africa and the Middle East. The Casper was developed by the Defense Research Unit of the Council for Scientific and Industrial Research in South Africa, originally for use by the South African Defense Forces and Police during the apartheid era. It was produced to counter the growing threat of landmines and IEDs deployed by insurgent forces in conflicts across southern Africa. The first batch of 140 Casper vehicles was ordered in 1980, and production has continued in various form ever since. Over the years, the Casper has undergone numerous upgrades to enhance its performance and survivability. The Casper Mark II and Mark III featured stronger engines and subsequent iterations such as the Casper 2000 and Casper NG2000 incorporated modernized component, including Mercedes-Benz and Powerstar North Benz frameworks. The Casper NG2000 introduced in 2013 represents the latest generation of the vehicle with enhanced ergonomics, electrical systems, and protection features. In 2015, the a South African defense company, acquired a 75 stack in BAE Systems Land System South Africa commencing its role in the continued production and development of the Casper. Since its deployment in the 1980s, the Casper has been used in a wide range of conflicts and operations, both military and police. Its durability and effectiveness in protecting troops from mines and ambushes made it a key asset during the South African border war and the Rhodesian Bush War, where it was used 
extensively for tube transport, convoy protection, and mine clearance. The Casper's ability to withstand mine blasts and IEDs led to its adoption by military and law enforcement agencies around the world. It became an essential vehicle in counterinsurgency operations, peacekeeping missions, and humanitarian efforts. The United Nations has used the Casper in various peacekeeping missions across Africa, including Somalia, where it has proven invaluable in areas with high mine and IED threats. In recent decades, the Casper has also played a role in conflict zones outside Africa, with its design directly influencing the development of modern embra vehicles used by the U.S. military in Iraq and Afghanistan. As the U.S. military faced increased IED threats during these conflicts, the Casper's V-shaped hull design became the blueprint for many embra vehicles deployed to protect American troops. In modern warfare, the Casper continues to serve a critical role in regions plagued by asymmetric warfare and insurgencies. Its versatility allows it to be used in troop transport, riot control, ambulance, mine clearance, and fire support roles. The vehicle's ability to withstand mine blasts and ambushes makes it ideal for convoy protection in areas prone to IED attacks, a threat that remains prevalent in many parts of the world today.